Uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'm familiar with the tower security. It's tight. Very tight. I'd like to help, fam, but... Now I just caught a whiff now. With all the CTOS cameras, it'd take him less than five to ID me. I ain't risking my pretty face. We need an Albion insider for our caper, one who's willing to turn coat. I've reached out to a contact who works in a nearby pub. Where better to find a bleakly disillusioned anti-hero numbing their conscience with drink, but secretly desperate for redemption. I've let our contact know what we're in the market for, and she's nearby. You think you got what it takes? Hiya. You lot certainly know how to pick your targets. You do know that Albion have set up their headquarters in there, right? We're not breaking in for fun. That prick, Nigel Cass, has some big unveiling planned. That's got to be shitty news for us and the city. This is why we joined DedSec, innit? Fucking Nigel Cass. You're right. Nothing good can come of this. Luckily, I hear loads of sob stories working in our pub. And near this place, quite a few from Albion are dissatisfied with the status quo. You turn on the charm, and I'm sure you can get one to join the good guys. Even got a candidate in mind. Interesting. Hit me up with their info, yeah? I'll have Bagley push it along. Good luck, love. We're aware of an Albion employee who might be approachable. I'm not sure how to go about converting an Albion employee. They're jackbooted thugs who regularly murder civilians. If finding a disenchanted employee is really that difficult, humanity is much worse off than I thought. It would also be quite useful to have someone on the inside. For however long that lasts, Nigel's real good at sniffing out spies. Personal experience speaking? Yeah, not really in a sharing mood right now, fam. You're a fighter. You ready to fight for the people? You say that like you're with DedSec. I know people. Let's leave it at that. Excellent. You can help me thump some Clan Kelly thugs. Go on then. Good enough. Here's the situation. A couple of gangster dimwits have been extorting this entire neighborhood for protection money. They keep it all in crypto, like idiots. Which means I can give everything back to the people with a few keyboard strokes. If I can get my hands on their private key. So you need dead sex help to find it. Bingo. If you send me the key, I'll recover everything these villains stole. Help me, and I'm confident we can work out a reciprocal arrangement. Use your imagination. Yeah, all right. I'll rally the comrades. Network traffic points to the private key bin on some kind of mobile server, probably a van in one of their hideouts. Make humanity redundant! If an Albion guard requests to see something on your person, surrender it immediately. Failure to do so is a crime. In case you forgot, the private key you're after is on a server in a van. Yep, yep.
That's the vehicle there. What makes this vehicle so special? I don't know. Wish I knew. Designed to go here. The more ways we get our message out, the better. being followed. You'll have to do something about that before you can deliver the vehicle. Crypto key is ours, but I may have made a bit of a scene. Bags, get me a good drop site and tell our hacker pal to meet us there. Got it. Pushing the location now. That's done it. You've gotten away. supposed to be here to drain the account I'm ensconced in a nearby hidey hole downloading the key wirelessly I for one don't intend to be in the line of fire if clan Kelly comes looking for their ill-gotten gains please that'll never happen we'll be in and out before oh no there they are clan Kelly hostiles incoming fantastic all right I'll keep the goons busy while you run the download going in Shit! Ah! 
But you will die someday. Best to make peace with that now. Drone speed deployed to apprehend the suspect. Transfer complete. I'll open a channel to our hacker friend. Splendid. You actually managed it. Now I can get this money back to the people it was taken from. If we're lucky, word hasn't spread that you've hung up your jackboots. Just try to put on your meek, harmless, broken-by-the-system face. Oh, and don't forget your uniform. All right, back to my day job. Looking sharp. Your ex-colleagues won't pay any attention to you unless you let them take a close look. first micro drone and it's officially as cute as the dickens i've decided to name it sebastian time to break into titus and take away nigel cass's newest toy project themis bagley any idea where that name comes from greek mythology themis was the goddess of divine justice you know the one with the sword Ooh, that is so nigel fucking cuss see school's useful for something besides social maladjustment find the schematics of the building and i'll work out the location of the themis project Someone more.
Four.
Look round for anything named Themis. Of course. Easy peasy. Well, if I was hiding a top-secret, morally dubious drone project like Themis, I would put it in the secure vault on the lowest level. You will have to hack your way past some pretty serious security, however. The elevator that leads to the secure vault that houses Themis is locked down. You will have to access the bypass terminal to use it. You will require a spider bot. You'll be using Sebastian and the rest of the microdrones to bypass security. But first you'll have to get by that laser array. I suggest a spider bot and steady nerves. Of course. Easy peasy. Our job is not an easy one, but it is an important one. Intruder alert!
All right, Sebastian, this is what you and your friends have been training for. Time to crash the security grid for Daddy. Go forth, little drones. Show Daddy what you can do. That's the spirit. She'll be pretty sick. This is taking too long, mate. Why don't you just shoot the damn door? I know what I'm doing. Thank you very much. Is meet Sebastian, another of our countless microdrone allies. All named Sebastian, of course. You can't iterate on perfection.
nearer the cause. Destroy them, Sebastian. And for God's sake, be careful. Sebastian. Oh, right. You should be able to access the Themis project room now. Let's ruin Nigel's fucking day! London. Once a beacon of civility, now a cesspool of lawlessness. It is clear that humanity can no longer police itself. Fortunately, we don't have to. Welcome to Project Themis. Albion has found a way to apply an existing system, LifeScore, a data aggregator of biometrics, personal information to our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats before they can do harm. They can go anywhere, see everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision. They miss drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act immediately and decisively. Fuck me, I knew it! The life score algorithm, my algorithm. I should have scrubbed it before I left. What do you mean, Hamish? You know how Themis works. No, fam. Well, yeah, this was years ago. We were developing a life score algorithm for what Cass called a peacekeeping system. Supposed to identify vulnerable civilians, not target them. Bloody hell. So in theory, Themis could be programmed to target anyone based on any number of parameters. Exactly. That's the way Cass thinks. Genius, but twisted. We have to stop this, and I know how. We delete the life score data, and Themis is done. Oh, for Christ! All right. And Finny. Yes, we'll have the award ceremony another time. Get out now. This may be entertaining. I've intercepted an audio transmission from Nigel Cass. No, no more excuses.